welcome to our Pearl of Africa Diaries with me, Ruth Naseje. And today, I take you to River Katonga. River Katonga is an amazing river in that it has changed direction over the years. It used to flow from Lake George to Lake Victoria, but because of tectonic movements in the area that caused a depression, specifically in the central part of Uganda, the swamps around Lake Kwamala in Mitiana have become its watershed. Part of it flows to Lake Victoria, while the other flows to Lake George. However, it has so many tributaries that feed it with its waters. Why not take a look? River Katonga is located in the southern part of Uganda, particularly in Remiaga County and Zimbabwe District. This stream forms a connection between Lake Victoria and Lake George, reflecting that it once drained away from Lake Victoria into Lake George. The mesmerized look in your eyes reveals that watching the beauty of River Katonga will make you revisit it each and every vacation of the year. The various types of exotic plants that lie on its waters are breathtaking and the birds that float on top of it are adorable. Katonga has also got animals which keep cool beneath its waters. These have led to what we now call the Katonga Wildlife Reserve. Great history lies on this river and worth mentioning is that River Katonga occupies a special place in Uganda's military history. It is here that the NRA Liberation Forces blocked access between Kampala City and the western and southern part of the country in the last siege that lasted about a month before marching on to the capital. The government forces combined with mercenaries failed to break the siege from the end of 1985 to early 1986 and after the NRA broke through Katonga, the rest became history. So getting to River Katonga is only three and a half hours from Kampala by road as shown on this Google map. So now tell me why you would not love to come tell your own story after spending some time at River Katonga. I am Ruth Naseja. We meet next time as we explore Uganda on New Vision TV's Pearl of Africa Diaries.